Here I'm going to bring in an AutoCAD detail, maybe like what you'd get from the Tolco side, or maybe something you've had on some you know, projects from another program that maybe you've exported them to DWG files so you could move them around freely from program to program. Uh, and here I've got a details palette project that all I have in this are details really um, as kind of a collection area. And I'm going to bring in an RTU protection detail. And again, you can do this with any DWG file. So first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go to view, create a new drafting view, and we'll call this RTU protection. I'm just going to go one to one here because I'm honestly not that concerned about uh, scale here. So I'm going to go ahead and click OK. So it creates this new uh, drafting view. I put it under coordination though. I'm going to put it with the rest the plumbing and fire protection. So now it's right there. Then I'm going to bring in CAD file. So this is that detail view. So it brings it in. It's pinned. I'm going to unpin it and then explode it. See, now it's a bunch of free objects. Now, this is the point where, you know, if maybe just through the import something came in goofy or you just didn't like the way it looked or you want to change just its appearance in any sort of way, then you can go ahead and do that now. So now that I've got this saved, I can close this file down and open it up in the future anytime I have any sort of new detail I want to include.